Hey Star Wars fans, welcome back to another Star Wars The Black Series action figure review. This time we've got a little bit of an older figure. It's not super old, but it's sort of more 2020, early 2021. Uh, the Galaxy's Edge, the last one I needed, R5P8. This is Hondo Inaka's uh, droid, astromech droid. Um, this is a cool one, I'm digging this one a lot. Um, yeah, this one is one of the ones with Commander Pyre. They were the last two ones to come out and they didn't actually hit stores down here in Australia, whereas we got the rest. So it's a, it's a pretty cool looking figure. This, yeah, like I said, this one's just eluded me. I've got had plenty on my eBay watch list. I just haven't bothered grabbing it, but my, yeah, my wife picked it up for me for my birthday. So I'm excited, looking forward to opening this one up and taking a good close look. So uh, let's do that and I'll be right back. All right, here is R5P8 and he's a funky looking little astromech droid. I like this guy, he's dirty, he's rugged and I like his teeth. It's a big smile. I always said on R5D4, I always thought like he had three eyes or a nose in the middle and then like the sort of red down there was a smile. But yeah, this is really bringing that to life. <laughs> he's fantastic. Yeah, same, same build as the other R5 units we've had in the Black Series line. He's just a simple repaint, but he's a good one. He's a good, good one. Um, one thing I do wish was kind of they chose the color. I don't, I don't know whether it's accurate or not. Um, whether that sort of dome is meant to be a different color than the rest. I kind of wish it was sort of the same sort of cream beige sort of color of the rest of the droid, but that's okay. Gives him a little bit more character. Again, he's got this sort of opening arms that the uh, R2 units have had. The little gadgets that stick out. And yeah, the wind up middle leg there. So he's going to look good next to the Black Series Hondo and Arca. Now this droid has been released before, and this was a Disney release, uh, part of their sort of um, Droid Depot figure sets. So this one sits in my uh, Clone Wars collection, just because that's sort of based on his Clone Wars appearance. Which again, it's a cool figure. It's similar to the uh, Builder droids that we used to get in Hasbro. Um, but yeah, Disney done their own sort of thing here with the Builder droids. So they're, they're kind of cool. Oh, I like he's got the gun on his head too. You can pop that out. I kind of wish the uh, kind of wish the six inch one had that as well. But uh, you know, I might be able to might be able to rustle something up there. We've got some old like power of the force weapons that are probably to scale with the six inch that could fit on top there. So yeah, you sort of see this one. He's got all the same color. A lot of that sort of dirtiness, but that's all good. Yeah, this one will go well. The other droid just fell on the floor, never mind. But yeah, looking forward to putting this guy alongside Hondo. They'll be fantastic together. But that Galaxy's Edge family. So yeah, it's a cool little droid, man. I'm digging him. I think he's cool. It's a nice one to have in the collection. I wasn't overly fussed about if I missed it or not. Um, knowing that it is difficult to get down here in Australia, but now that I've got him, very, very glad to have him. Fantastic stuff. So big shout out to my wife. For, she knows, she knows these things. She knows about this stuff more than she lets on. <laughs> uh, my wife's a big Star Wars fan. Not, not on my level, of course, but she knows, she, she gets it. She listens to me, she pays attention. So yeah, I'd love to hear your comments. Please sound out down below. Love to hear what you think of this guy. He's cool, man. I like that smile. <laughs> yeah, I like the weathering. I think it looks good. All right, guys, if you please give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you haven't subscribed already and I'll see you on the next video. Until then, may the force be with you always.